In ahead of Election Day, both Sarasota and Manatee counties are on pace for a strong and possibly record turnout in the primary election. SNN Samantha Sonner has that. With 18.1% voter turnout in Sarasota and 17.7% voter turnout in Manatee ahead of Election Day, both counties could be looking at record turnout for Tuesday's primary. Some primaries we get a 21-24% turnout, so it looks like we're on pace to have a record turnout in this primary election on Tuesday. For a primary race, it could be, yeah. yeah we're getting a lot of turnout that we had not quite expected, especially in the absentees. What's behind that turnout? Sarasota County Supervisor of Elections Ron Turner says high-profile governor races and national attention on Florida is one factor. There's, you know, kind of national interest in what's going on in Florida elections. We are a swing state here, an important state, the third largest state in the country. Manatee County Supervisor Michael Bennett says that national interest is a double-edged sword. I don't like the fact that the uh, president is interfering with the primary races. I think that's truly up to the people to elect those people in the primary. But it's good to see that at least there has been a, a surge, if you will. Tuesday's race is also more than just a primary. School board races on the ballot are open to all voters. There's something for everyone to vote on tomorrow, regardless of your political party affiliation, uh, whether you're a registered Democrat, Republican, whether you're a no party affiliation, or whether you're registered with a minor party. Elections officials are now waiting to see if that turnout finishes strong on Election Day. Encouraging everybody to get out there and vote tomorrow, take care of the neatest opportunity that we have in our country, and that's to help name our particular selected learning, uh, leaders. It's important for voters to get out to the polls to make their voices heard. Many people have done that already, but they, you know, voters can go to their polls tomorrow from 7 to 7, and they have that last opportunity to make sure their voice is heard at the ballot box. Reporting in Sarasota, I'm Samantha Sonner, SNN, the Suncoast News Network. And if you're unsure of your polling place, we'll have links to both election websites at our website at SNNTV.com. And a reminder, SNN will have live election coverage beginning at 8 p.m. Tuesday.